The Wild Kinky Sex Lives of the Irish Nuns In the hallowed halls of Irish convents, where piety and devotion were expected to prevail, a veil of secrecy concealed a multitude of scandals that rocked the foundations of the religious community. In this compelling narrative, we will dive deep into the world of Irish nuns, exploring the hidden secrets, controversies, and profound impact of these scandals on individuals and the broader society. Prepare to be captivated as we uncover the untold stories that shed light on the dark side of religious life. Let's peel back the layers and delve into the gripping tales of Irish nuns entangled in controversy, shedding light on a hidden side of religious life. The Forbidden Love Affair Sister Mary, known for her impeccable piety and commitment, had always been a model of devotion. However, her heart harbored a forbidden love for a local parish priest. Amidst the rigidity of religious life, forbidden love affairs blossomed within the convent walls. Sister Mary and Sister Elizabeth, bound by vows of chastity, found themselves drawn to one another. Their clandestine romance unfolded in secret, risking their reputations and spiritual obligations. As the truth emerged, their love was met with condemnation and scrutiny, forcing them to grapple with the complexities of desire, faith, and societal expectations. The Fall of Sister Margaret Sister Margaret, esteemed for her benevolence and unwavering commitment, faced a fall from grace that sent shockwaves through the convent. Whispers of her involvement in financial misconduct and the misuse of charitable funds started to circulate. As an investigation unraveled the truth, the once revered sister stood accused of greed and deception, shattering the trust placed in her and tarnishing the reputation of the entire community. The Illicit Affairs Within the tightly knit community of nuns, illicit affairs and forbidden relationships festered. Sister Bridget found herself entangled in a passionate relationship with a fellow sister, their love defined the strict tenets of their faith. The discovery of their forbidden liaison sent shockwaves through the convent, forcing them to confront the consequences of their actions and the conflict between their desires and their sacred vows. The Embezzlement Scandal Within the walls of Street Bridget's convent, Sister Catherine had long been entrusted with the finances of the community. However, her yearning for a life of luxury led her down a treacherous path. Unbeknownst to her fellow nuns, Sister Catherine embezzled funds, diverting them to fuel her extravagant lifestyle. When the scandal finally unraveled, the shock reverberated through the convent, tarnishing the reputation of all who dwelled within its walls, the lost faith. Sister Agnes, once a beacon of faith and devotion, found herself grappling with doubt and disillusionment. The weight of religious expectations became too burdensome, leading her on a journey of self-discovery and questioning. Her crisis of faith sent shockwaves through the convent, challenging the rigid structure of religious life and forcing the community to confront the realities of human frailty and the complexities of the human spirit. The Battle for Liberation Deep within the convent walls, a group of courageous nuns dared to challenge the oppressive patriarchal structures that confined them. Sister Teresa emerged as a fearless advocate, leading the charge for women's empowerment within the religious community. Through protests, petitions, and impassioned speeches, they demanded equal rights, opportunities, and the freedom to make their own choices. Their battle for liberation sparked a revolution within the convent, inspiring countless others to question the status quo and fight for their own autonomy. The Revelations of Abuse of Power Behind the veils of obedience and submission, some nuns wielded their positions of authority to manipulate and exploit others. Sister Veronica, a respected figure within the convent, used her power to intimidate and control those under her charge. But her reign of tyranny came to an end when brave nuns stood up against her, exposing her abuse of power. The revelations shocked the entire community, forcing a reckoning with the systemic issues that allowed such abuses to persist. The quest for justice and healing. In the wake of the scandals, a collective cry for justice echoed throughout the convent. Survivors of abuse, former nuns, and concerned community members united in their pursuit of accountability and healing. They formed support groups, advocated for legal action, and sought restitution for the harm inflicted upon them. Through their resilience and determination, 
they transformed their pain into a powerful force for change, ensuring that the scandals of the past would not be forgotten or repeated. The Path of Redemption Amidst the scandals and turmoil, there were nuns who found solace in the Path of Redemption. Sister Mary, haunted by her forbidden love affair, sought forgiveness and embarked on a journey of self-reflection and atonement. Through acts of service, genuine repentance, and a renewed commitment to her faith, she found redemption and a chance to rebuild her life. Her story became a testament to the power of grace and the capacity for transformation, reminding us all of the inherent human capacity to heal and grow. The struggle for autonomy. While cloistered away, some nuns yearned for independence and autonomy beyond the constraints of convent life. Sister Bridget, a spirited and intellectually curious nun, questioned the restrictive nature of her existence. Her insatiable thirst for knowledge and her desire to engage with the world beyond the convent walls collided with the disapproval of the institution. In her pursuit of personal freedom, she challenged the patriarchal structures that bound her, risking excommunication and igniting a fervent debate on the role of women within the church. Conclusion The scandals involving Irish nuns have left a deep mark on the history and collective memory of Ireland. These incidents have shaken the public's trust in religious institutions and have led to significant societal and cultural shifts. The stories of abuse, neglect, and mistreatment suffered by vulnerable individuals in the care of Irish nuns are heartbreaking and serve as a reminder of the importance of safeguarding the welfare of all people, especially the most vulnerable among us. The abuses that occurred within these institutions were a betrayal of the trust placed in them to provide care, guidance, and support. The revelations of the scandals have prompted a reckoning within Irish society, leading to calls for justice, accountability, and the establishment of truth and reconciliation processes. Survivors of abuse have bravely come forward to share their stories, seeking recognition, restitution, and closure. These scandals have also sparked important conversations about power dynamics, gender roles, and the influence of religious institutions in society. They have challenged traditional notions of authority and highlighted the need for transparency, accountability, and the protection of human rights. In recent years, steps have been taken to address the historical injustices and provide support for survivors. Investigations, inquiries, and redress schemes have been initiated to seek truth, acknowledge the pain and suffering endured, and offer avenues for healing and justice. It is essential to recognize that the scandals involving Irish nuns do not define the entirety of the religious community. Many nuns and religious orders have dedicated their lives to serving others with compassion, humility, and integrity. Their contributions to education, healthcare, and social services cannot be overlooked.